Sophie Willie is a writer and performer who broke out onto the scene with the feisty character DJ Bird who became infamous after committing suicide. She's currently on tour with When To Run, where a one woman play where she plays four different characters. And joining us in the studio, we have Sophie. How are you today, Sophie? Good, how are you? I'm fine. <laughs> um, first question, you first hit the scene with the character DJ Bird. Tell us how that came about. DJ Bird came about, um, she was a satire on stuff that I saw happening um, within music culture at the time. It was 1997 mm. I was writing her and um, she started off as um, a comic strip that mm. I was just doing for fun and um, I cut up um, music magazines and, um, and um, did cut and paste collages and I, and I drew, actually drew DJ Bird and um, the story, she was kind of an, an e evil serial um, DJ girlfriend. Like like, wag, like you see wags today, girls want, you always wanted to go out with DJs at the time. Then I started writing um, her diaries, like her diary column, um, because I had to stop drawing it because it, it took up a lot of time cutting up all the <laughs> pictures of DJs and stuff. What did she look like? What did she look like? Yeah. Oh, she had, she had um, the cartoon, um, oh. when, she was, when she was in a magazine she looked a bit different, but the cartoon, she had um, fringe like this actually. And um, she had um, dark hair and, and, and ponytails, oh, cute okay. ponytails that would go like into devil's horns oh. when she was being evil <laughs> or snorting um, cocaine. <laughs> Playing all the different characters, did you have a voice coach? Um, it was when I took Gwen to run to Edinburgh Festival, that's where it premiered. Um, I, had, um, I didn't have a theatre director. Um, my producer was directing me, so oh. the the voices um, were all my own work. Then I realised I needed a theatre director um, to really differentiate um, the characters, and she's worked a little bit on the voices to make, mm. especially the Emma character and the Celia character, distinct mm. because they're both quite posh. Yeah. The Celia character, I based that voice on Celia Johnson. You know the film Brief Encounter. Yeah. Because um, okay. I I worked on that character before Went to Run, and um, I um, would listen to Brief Encounter uh, with headphones and watch the films and say the, the certain lines over and over again until I got the voice. I try to think positive thoughts every minute of the day. The important thing about her is the line where she says, I don't really talk like this. <laughs> it's just the way I sound inside. That, that's very important because she'd probably speak like um, a floaty yoga teacher in real yeah. life, but inside she's just very fraught very uptight woman. On your MySpace, Paula Radcliffe is your second top friend. Did she convince you to run? Yeah, me and Paula. <laughs> Best friends. Um, she's not seen my show though. I've never met oh. her actually. Oh. <laughs> no, I wrote to, I've not invited her, so maybe that's why. When I was um, researching the show, um, I got into running. I used to just think jogging was funny. So that's kind of one of the reasons that I wrote it, um, to laugh at running. <laughs>